So I predict Leah and Ramona are out. Yeah. Yeah, Leah and Ramona. Hi everyone, welcome back to Nala Tarot. Where I use tarot to see what we can learn from a situation. This is not meant to be negative gossip. So it's just intuitive based, it's not fact based. So please don't treat those like true or false. This, I'm usually accurate, but doesn't mean I'll be accurate here. And it's just more for fun and to see what we can learn from a situation. So I was just listening to and watching and like scrolling through Instagram and that kind of stuff. And I've been watching the Real Housewives of Ultimate Girls Trip. I really like it. It's, Reminds me of the old days of uh, Real Housewives when I used to love watching it. So it got me thinking about New York because I feel like Luann is on New York um, and I really like, I like her. I don't know, I don't like what she did to Rona even though I don't like Rona. Um, and I just got thinking, I was like, I've never been inclined to watch Real Housewives of New York even though I am from New York. I used to live in New York when it was like at its prime time. I met Bethany and I know people who know some of the other housewives so it's funny that I never really got into it and I thought about it and I was like well their age group is like way older than I am and I feel like there's a connection that's not landing with the audience anymore with Real Housewives of New York and I think partially Ebony is to blame even though I like Ebony a lot but I think it's all around. I don't think it's just Ebony. So I wanted to see what they could do to revive it. The energy of the production of Andy and so forth and what they want to make happen versus what it isn't. Again, this is intuitive based, it's not fact based. So I strongly see with King of Swords, Queen of Cups and the Lovers, they want a main love story line. They want a love story line that isn't uh it's almost like there's a lack of substance in the love department and you know everybody loves a good love story especially on housewives and so they're going to be looking for that they're also going to be looking for seven of pentacles the wheel and the hangman oh okay first let me just say they're going to be looking for somebody who has made money themselves like a bethany type if they can't get bethany and i predicted before that they want bethany they want her very badly actually but if they can't get bethany they're going to look for somebody who is like her who is self-made and made a lot of money basically a rags to riches story they want one person like that so with the hanged man there are going to be two people i see getting fired two housewives are going to get fired one of them i think is ramona i think definitely she's out the other one let me see it's not luan luan's gonna stay let's see who else is going to get fired who else is going to get fired Ah, uh, Leah, Leah. So I, I predict Leah and Ramona are out. Yeah, yeah, Leah and Ramona are out. So with Magician, the Magician, Seven of Wands, by Pentacles, they're going to be looking for two other people um, because right now they really only have Luan. That's the only one. They want Bethany back. So who was in the Sonia? Sonia's gonna come back. So Luann and Sonia are going to come back. I'm not crazy about Sonia, but that's it. Luann and Sonia are going to come back, but those are the only two. The rest is gonna be a big shifting. I think Ebony might come back. They want her, but she might not. Everybody else is gonna be a big shift up. So with the star six of wands, they want more people. They want people like a household name like a trump name like a hilton name uh what else who else is like a like kennedy name you know they want that they want like empire 
the star and six of wands people who are known already that they can bring to the show i think that's the direction that they are headed i do see Dorinda coming back eventually not this season but they want bethany it's just up to her if she decides <clears throat> to come back or not it's funny i used to i mean when i met bethany she was so sweet but i used to really like bethany based off of the fact that when i met her she was sweet because i met a lot of celebrities who have not been nice have actually been really awful um she was so down to earth so kind considerate but when i saw her defending chrissy teigen it just made me like and granted we can all have an opinion but chrissy teigen bullied her 16 year old and continued so they're not just 16 year old i mean many others but I just made me look at her a little differently and like seeing other things too so I understand now why people don't like her just putting that out there so the high priestess nine of cups king of cups okay so they want it to return to more of a like I said down to earth but also not as serious they don't want it as serious with the hermit and nine of pentacles they want it easy like going and that's why they want to bring in a family they want in a they want at least two people from a family like the kennedys the trumps the um hiltons they want people who are known for money so that's what i have for you i love you all please comment below i know i mentioned trump but this is not anything political so I will delete any political comments. I'm not a political channel at all. I'm more speaking about the money aspect than politics. So just putting that out there. I love you all. Thank you so much for watching. Take care.